All right, guys, it's 7.30 a.m. Saturday morning, and I am ready to win the Masters. I have my Rogue Energy here to spruce me up because it's so early. You can get 20% off using my code Apex Sound, by the way. But it's time to try and win the Masters for the very first time. As you know, if you've been watching this series, I've come up heartbreakingly short three times, four times, five times in a row. And we've missed out by one shot, I think, four times in a row now. So it's time to finally do this thing. We're playing alongside Patrick Cantley. We're tied for the lead heading into the final round here. And I am ready to put it all to bed. All right, it's time to finally do this thing. Patrick Cantley, stop me once. He won't stop me again. It's time to banish our demons. All right, let's do this thing. I'm hyped. I hope you guys are hyped. Thank you for all the support. Final round at Augusta, here we go. Sunday at Augusta. Three simple words that bring to mind those timeless images of yesteryear. And what lies in store today? What decisions to be made? What parts to agonize over? What roars will echo and reverberate through the second nine? And who will be left standing in the twilight? Trophy aloft sporting a new green jacket this is the final round of the masters i'm wearing my green jumper but after this round i'm going to be slipping into my green jacket all right it's time to go it's time to do this thing if i fail again it's never going to happen for us i can't lose again not when we've come so far not when we've played so well this week i refuse to lose and patrick cantley you're not going to be the man to stop me this time all right, I'm going to hit three wood, even though the wind's into us. Yes, I'm still going to hit three wood. Spectacular rounds of golf. By the time twilight comes calling later Drawing today, a little bit more than I would have anticipated have there, but that's going to be perfect. It's going to be a perfect Sunday angle leaderboard. right up We've got a time the green top, onto the flag stick, 177 yards. A bit longer than you would want Included on the first hole, but it's better than risking going into the bunker and giving yourself a really awkward shot and starting with a bogey and just, yeah. Patrick Cantman's doing the same thing. See, it's not... It's not stupid, all right? But yeah, this weekend I'm quite busy, so I got to get up early and record the this video this morning. And you know what? It's so early. My girlfriend's still asleep. My neighbors are all probably still asleep that um, I won't be able to get too angry. You know, I can't, I can't shout and scream so we can keep our cool here. And that's all that's going to, that's all that we're going to need to keep calm, cool, and collected here in the morning, all right? And we're going to do it. Patrick Cantley hits an okay shot here on the first. I'm mixing strawberry kiwi with snowstorm this morning as well. Get a little bit of caffeine into me early. And uh, get me going. Because we're going for a, a nice long walk today. We're going down to Douglas. Which is about an hour walk away with the dogs. Um, so yeah. I wouldn't have had time to record it later. And still get it up today. Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to record this. And then we're going to send it to the boy Santa Kagi. Then I'm going to go out for the day, and then I'll be back, and I'll work on uploading it. 192 should be perfect. I just need to be aware of the wind. The wind is coming off the right. It's not extreme. I don't want to miss this off the right of the green. I'm going to go with something like this. That is so good. Sit. 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 Yeah, really good shot. Really good shot. 12 That's foot above the flag. Yeah, and it's a great start green here at Augusta. Exactly what you need. We just need the AI not to be disgustingly, stupidly good. Green. All right? And I'm not even going to start to celebrate unless we're bloody five shots ahead with two holes to go. Because with the way the AI played towards the end of the round, man, I'm scared. Patrick Cantor nearly makes it. So we have a chance. A big chance to take a one-up lead early here. And these kinds of putts could end up being vital. It turns left off the rip, but it turns back to the right at the end of this putt. But I do think it's going to turn. It looks like it turns slightly more to the right. I'm going to go something like this, because it does turn back a little bit. We have to be aware of that. Wow, it turned back sooner than I thought, actually. It started turning back, like, less than halfway into that putt, which is interesting. But, c'est la vie, this is the way. It's going to be a par on one. It was a good effort there with the with the flat stick. And it was a good effort uh, overall on hole one. Okay, Can't okay, complain too much about a par there. It's a difficult mm -hmm. hole. And we'll be looking for an eagle on two, eh? We'll be looking for an eagle on two. 
Patrick Cantley taps in for his car as well. And we're both off and running at Augusta. The two leaders who will probably not have competition from anyone else today. Alex Noren has a slim chance to get back into it at 11 under par. But he would need to shoot like a 62, something like that to get back into it. He would need to be breaking course records like we have done this week. Okay. Oh my god, wins with us as well. This is... This could be a green light special here, boys. Keep drawing, keep drawing, keep drawing. That could be the best drive I've ever hit in this game. That's a wedge in. Hit the down slope. Oh my god, that's going to be a wedge in. And this is gonna be a good I mean, come on. You're never going to have a better chance to eagle a golf hole than this one right here. 158 yards. Patrick Cantley. Down the right side. Okay. More important nah. distance here as, as Bora would say. Nat. Nah. Good shot, Nat. <laughs> oh, Bora, what an idiot that guy is. All right. Patrick Cantley lays up. He's still I'm banking on him still making a birdie though. Cuz they always do this. They play the par 5 in the most awkward yeah, way possible shot. but still walk Same off with a birdie. Okay, the pin is down Big there as well. Interesting. They don't have much green to work with. That's clearly too much. This might even be too much, to be honest. What about a finesse pitching wedge? We'll try a little finesse P-dub. Finesse P-dub, baby. If we miss it to the left, it'll come back down in anyway. Oh my god, did I underswing that. Don't matter. <laughs> oh my. It's like we had a 6-iron or a 9-iron in our hand. That's just the wrong club. <laughs> I, I hit a pitching wedge, damn it. Patrick Cantley playing way out to the right. It's hardly going to come in that much, Patrick. Right. Strange shot choice by Patrick Cantley. Okay, Watch him still make the birdie, though. I'm telling you. I told you guys they make the strangest choices on the par fives, but somehow still walk off with a birdie. It's bloody annoying. Because when you're trying to pull away from them, you're like, oh, I might be able to make an eagle and gain two shots on him here. It's like, or then you end up just with the same score. You're a wizard, Harry. Every time, man. <laughs> it's like, I'm telling you, every time. They, they play the par fives in just the strangest ways. But we can still gain a shot on him. We can still gain a shot on him, and we should, realistically. There's not that much in this. Right in the middle. Eagle on two. We move to 17 under and one shot clear here at Augusta. Come on, baby. Right, I'm just going to hit a three wood then, yeah. Give myself a... Give myself a normal distance shot here. Because there's no point in driving it up there and leaving yourself in an awkward flop Driving distance. That's a perfect distance there, 80 oh, yards. We can play a little finesse or a spinner or a pitch shot. We'll make one of them work. I maybe should have hit an iron and give myself a full shot like he said. But Patrick Hanton is in driver here. Go on, Patty Ice. Patty, Patty Ice. They're By the way, guys, in the real right life side. tomorrow, uh, going golfing in one of the better ah, courses solid. in Cork. So I told you guys my girlfriend got me a voucher for FOTA um, later this year. This was one of the other courses she was so thinking about right getting right me, but we're going playing nine holes, me and my cousins. Uh, it's a great course. Not as good as FOTA, but um, still very, very good. And I'm excited to play it. I'm excited to, to play a different course. Because I really haven't played that many of the courses around Ireland. I really need to get into that and play more of them. And kind of um, broaden my horizons with the golf courses around Ireland. Because there's some really beautiful ones. But uh, this is one of, the, one of the better ones. And I'm excited to try it out. Now zip, 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 zip. Zippity zip. Right, we're below the hole. Good shot. Not ideal. Twelve foot. I would like to be a little bit closer, but honestly, not horrible. So yeah, exciting weekend for me, boys. And I might get the camera out and record a few holes down in Castle Castle Martyr is the name of the golf course, by the way. Uh, I might get a few few holes recorded or something. But I'm still kind of trying to get back into golf okay. a little bit, so I'm not going to be like doing full course vlogs yet. The weather's just quite not now, night, quite, not quite birdie. there. But uh, I really am starting to get back into it now. I played twice recently, and I'm playing for a third time now kind of just doing nine holes at the moment because my leg does, i do feel it in my leg after i play 
golf. Um, so I, I'm not up to doing like the courses are only 13 holes open at the moment anyway because of the the winter conditions. All right, so this is up the hill. Doesn't look like there's much in it. Like there's a tiny like you see at the start right at the very at my feet it's turning to the right that's why it says above but then it turns back the other way a little bit stronger I would say so I would say it's actually going to turn left to right even though this is above I think this is going to turn left to right a little bit more than right to left so I'm going to play it like here money cash money come on patrick can't is gonna make a par i thought this was for birdie for a second because i wasn't paying attention to his golf shots so thank god we're two shots clear of patrick can't now come on i'm not getting ahead of myself at any point in this round though even if i go three four shots clear because that's when the ai starts to play the best when you start to play really well the ai just goes wait a second <laughs> and especially towards the end of a round like remember I, I don't know if it was the last masters i did or the one before i think it was the last one but i was playing really good and there was six holes left i was maybe three four ahead and scotty Scheffler went six under for the last six and one by one like that was heartbreaking man. that pin position is basically just impossible i have to play for the slope behind it all right we're gonna play for the slope behind it just play a little bit of a big fade here against the wind Sometimes playing a fade against the wind isn't the best option, but I think this is actually really our only option to stop it. I just hit it a little slow. I think that would have been pretty decent if I didn't hit it slow. Maybe I took a little bit too much off it with the fade, but it was worth the shot because otherwise it's pretty much impossible to stop this. And it's better to miss it short than it is to miss it long. If you miss it long, you're pretty much done so. We'll see how Patrick Cantley does because like, I do find like this is pretty much flat out impossible to stop. He's bunker as well. Or unless you do that. Oh, that's so good. That is so good, man. That's what a shot by Cantley. And now we really have to get up and down because he's going to make a birdie ahead. here. He's just seeing me make two, a birdie eagle now and he's going to be like, yeah, we can't allow that. You know? 100% that's going to be the, the thinking of the AI right now. Really good. Really good. Important bunker shot. Is Cantley going to make the birdie and get back within one? I think he will. I'm going to bank that he will. I got to just assume that Cantley is going to make everything today so I'm not frustrated when he does. I, just, I probably still will be a little bit frustrated if he starts making everything, but that's low. That's low. That's low. That's low. What? That looked low all the way. Does it turn back into the right? I Will certainly help it, it actually does. Wow. Okay. I, I thought it turned the other way the whole way. Can't be back within one. Okay, that one finished All right. That is some birdie on that hole because that birdie is uh, that hole is ridiculously tough. I find. I'll take a par there, honestly. I'll take a par there and not complain at all. All right, tough par four here, Magnolia. Let's see what Cantley can do. He's playing three wood. Full of little hollows makes getting an approach to birdie range. Oh. No small feet. That's a strange decision. I would have loved to start went into the bunker. He would have been fucked, but he has 233 left. It's a long, long way in on a hole like this. I'm going to hit the power drive. Because I think it could give us a little bit of a bonus. Oh, so good. Just a perfect draw. A power draw right there. Oh, yes. I'll be in wedge distance there, Just nearly. What, you want at this point around, you're trying to find a rhythm. what a shot. 360 yards, 144 that's left. And that's a huge advantage on this hole, because so I find coming in with the longer gloves on this hole, it's so hard to kind of get the distance control with all the hills and the undulations around this green. I always find this to be a quite difficult hole to actually get close to the pin. I'm always like 50, 40 foot away, like with these slopes. Like, watch the way this slopes away. No way that gets over. Really? I thought 100% that was bouncing down to the right and coming back down mm -hmm. long, but Cantley's found some nice form now. That's a great shot. Well, we're in trouble, tap. guys. Cantley's decided now, after seeing how well I'm playing, that uh, he's not going to allow it. Such a good shot. Come on, baby. Sit, sit, sit. Really? Still that far? I'm further away than Cantley, for God's sake. All right, turns left to right the whole way, pretty much. We've had a lot of double breakers so far, but this one's just a straight, a straight breaker. 
A straight breaker, man. I might be giving it a little too much here, but it breaks the whole way, so I'm going to say... It's downhill as well, so I'm going to say something like this. Yeah, it was a little too much. A little too much pace and a little bit too much break, but... Not terrible, I guess, and we'll hopefully sell it for the par. As long as Cantley doesn't make this, we're okay. We've given him a little bit of a read, but I would really appreciate it if he didn't birdie the two hardest holes on the fucking course, Cantley, back to back. That would be awesome. We made it. Oh, God, man, this is just going to be a nightmare. This whole day is going to be a nightmare, because every time I start to make birdies and stuff, Cantley's just going to go, nope, I'm going to make birdies too. Every time, man. Good par. Yeah, it's important par. It is a par. We stay tied up. Yeah. I go 300 through 5, but Cantley matches me. 300 through 5. And he birdies the two toughest holes on the course. He had some crazy bounces on those two holes as well. Like, where I'm like, what the hell? I don't know what you can do against that, but we'll try our best. we got to stay positive. Stay positive and stay on him. I'd love to see a bogey from you here, Cantley. I'd absolutely love to see a bogey from you here, pal. Ooh, into a 12 mile an hour wind. I don't think that's enough. I need to finesse a six. Alright, let's try it. Wind. Wind, help me out, help me out, help me out. Great shot, great shot. Stops okay. dead. Cantley, this isn't an easy up and down, I don't think. <laughs> See this, close? Oh, he botched it. He just duffed it. Right, so this breaks slightly. Right to left. I don't think there's too much in this, you know. It is below at my feet, but it turns the other way. Not much. Almost dead straight, as he says. He heard him. Smashed it, though. Right in the middle, I smashed it! What a birdie that is! 19 under! I won't be denied by this scumbag, Cantley! I won't be! I've had enough from you, Patrick! Yes! Two shot swing, two shot swing, Patrick bogeys, and we birdie, and we're two shots clear again! Get in there! What a goddamn bloody masterclass that is go come on baby three holes left on the front nine let's try to be 20 under at the end of the front nine all right at least 20 under at the end of the front nine we're pulling away from naran and the boys by at the rate of 90 here again we have a round like stenson and fucking phil mickelson at the open you know let's go three wood i'm gonna go three wood because i feel like it's kind of good to take a little bit of spin off this shot nearly. You don't want to be spinning yeah, it and zipping it back. That's still going to be only like 150? 130. Wow, less. All right, still a wedge. Yeah, I'm glad I hit that then. I think that's a much better shot than having like a 106 shot or a, like I don't really like that. I prefer having like a full wedge in. But let's see if Cantley's going to bounce back from the bogey after seeing me make a birdie. I don't think he's going to stand for that too much. Patty Ice. Patty, Patty, Ice. What a man, what a man, what a man. All right, Cantley, what you got for us, son? A big fade. Holy moly, that's awful. A terrible golf shot by Patrick Cantley. And he could be feeling the heat here. He could be feeling the heat. He lands at someone's foot. It's on his foot. Play it as it lies, he says. We can take a little bit off this. Oh, big fast, though. No. Zip. That's a nightmare. That's an awful shot. Oh, my God. That might be worse than Cantley's because I have to come down just an absolute myriad of huge hills. I hit it so bad that I didn't even come close to the hills. Oh, no. Cantley's is all over the shop now all of a sudden after those two birdies. Right. If we can get out of here with the power, we'll surely gain one on Cantley's, though. Big slope. I don't even know how to play this, man. I just don't even know how to play this. It's downhill all the way. I, I don't think, like, I'm genuinely serious. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to stop this. Like, as much as I would love to say I, I can get this close, I I'm I think I might have to put this into the bunker. Like, seriously, I'm not even joking.
so lucky. That is so lucky, dude. Oh my god. Dude, that was in the bunker 100%. That could be the thing that makes you win a Masters tournament, man. I cannot believe that just happened. Oh my goodness me. That is as lucky as it gets right there. Holy shitaki mushrooms, son. Can't he makes his bogey putt, but that is so big. That's what she said. This is to go three shots ahead now. Oh, we're already three shots ahead. This is to stay three shots ahead. Holy shit, mate. I cannot believe that just happened, man. I nearly missed that. I nearly missed that. <laughs> Holy shit. All right. Bogey free through the first seven. We head to the eighth hole at 19 under par. We had a beautiful eagle on eight this week already. If we could get another one, that could really secure our lead here. Oh, my God, man. That is so lucky. We were 100% walking off with a bogey or worse there. Ah, it's into the wind. But we can still get it up there in two. Just need to not hit the bunkers. Yep, that's fine. Uh, it's a little bit too far left. I'm going to have to play a draw, but it's still fine. Through 63. I think I can still get it there. Where's the pin on Sunday? I think the Sunday pin is the back. The back left pin, right? If I'm not mistaken. So if we play a big draw, I think we can make that work. Just get it running onto the green. Can't they take in a three-wood option? A little bit strange, but... Uh, He's, he's always been a strange lad, this can't be lad, you know? He's always been a strange, strange boy. We're in a good position to win this. We're in pole position right now. Pole position. Call me Max Verstappen because I'm in pole position right now. Let's see if can't lay. Is taking DOD or is that a three wood? Kind of looked like driver, but I think it's just a three wood. Okay. So, yeah, it is that back left pin position. Like I said. Oh, no, I don't want to hit driver. Power approach three wood is nearly too much. Like, I'm not even trolling. I just need to hit normal three wood. Because I gotta hit a big high draw with it. All right, watch this shot, guys. This is either gonna make or break the tournament. No, it's not really, but. It could definitely make it. Mm, dude, if that lands on the green, if it carries onto the green. That's pretty much exactly what I was looking for. But uh, I just, it was a little bit short. And I think the slow might have hurt us there as well. Like, if that carries maybe another two yards, it lands on the green. And when it lands on the green, they they run so much. I feel like that could have been absolutely sensational. Patrick Cantlay. Giving himself a birdie chance. Remember I said they, how they always make birdies on par fives no matter what way they play the hole? It's another one of those instances. Guarantee he makes that. Guarantee he makes that. So we need a two putt. And just make a birdie it's and get the hell out of here, right? You know what? There's not that much on the on the line that I'm taking for some reason. There's not that much. It turns right to left, of course. Quite significantly at the start, but bottoms out at the end. It doesn't do that much. It's just downhill towards the end of this putt. I reckon it's going to be a downhiller. I'm going to go for like 55 foot from right to left at the start quite significantly, but then cams down. I'm going to go with something like this. <laughs> that would have been sensational that would have sent the crowd into raptors that would have sent me over the edge that's to get to 20 under par and stay three shots clear because i already know patrick's making this he doesn't he doesn't Okay, four shot lead here four shot lead here at augusta by the way guys please do check out my other channel the hound i am currently doing um loads of videos over there i'm, I'm uploading every day i'm streaming suicide squad kill the justice league as well i've done three streams for that i think i'll do a couple more to finish the game off on stream um and i'm doing a gta 4 playthrough i'm doing a like a dragon infinite wealth playthrough i'm gonna be doing banishers and overall just having a great time over there with the games that i'm playing and kind of just really enjoy my time so if you're interested in story games and stuff like that check out that channel uh, we're having a blast with it
Just gonna hit a three wood down here because driver will honestly run through, I think. So I'm just gonna hit three wood. And things are looking real good here for the back nine, my friends. If we can get out of here with the power, because this hole can be quite dangerous, actually. If we can get out of here with the power with 20 under heading to the back nine, we're four shots clear. That is really, really a great position to be in to win this tournament. All right? This is the best possible position to be in to win this one. Oh, we were 15 under. Yeah, so I'm five under right now. Five under through eight holes. That's really good. Really, really good. Can't they had back-to-back bogeys there, which really helped our cause before he had the power on the power five. So can't they has fallen apart a little bit. And he might go into the mulch here. He gets away with it. He gets away with it big time. No, what kind of shot that was. He played a, a bloody stinger almost. It felt like it was a runner. From the fairway, but he leaves himself in a good position, actually. Let's see if well, he can put one close to make a birdie. I reckon he's going to bounce back sooner rather than later. To the back third of this green. It's going to require some good calculations on yardage and proper execution to get the ball to sit on the right plateau. That's not going to be easy. Now, oh, guys, it's in our hands from here, all right? If I lose it from here, I'm going to have to shoulder some of the blame no matter how well the AI plays, you know? Unless the AI goes like 9 under, nine, through 9 on the back 9, I won't be like too crazy about it then, because I, I could have still gone 5-400 and lost, but... Like, I don't know. We have to we have to play well. Let's do this. Is this enough? I think I might hit the finesse pitching wedge. Yeah, good choice. Good choice. I've left myself a little bit of an awkward run. I was I was scared to play out further left though, because well, I did not want to miss in that bunker. Horrible right putt. To left from start to finish. We got a bit of a read off his. Right to left clearly throughout the whole putt, and then he's kind of oh, a, a little too hard, but pretty good pace for Patrick Cantley. Four foot for a birdie, or for a par rather. And for him to stay at 16 under. If we could make this, this would really be the cherry on top of an absolutely sensational front nine. Um, I don't think mine turns as much as his did, because his turned a lot at the start, but still turns. No. Oh my god, I thought I was going down the hill. Man, what the fuck? Like, how much did that turn? This will be a five foot five like, it did not show it turning that significantly, I feel like, on the goddamn thing. But that's insane to me that that turned that much. Big save, though. Big save. If I had bogeyed that, I would have never forgiven myself, to be honest. That is the stupid si shit that ends up costing you at the end of the tournament. But great par. for four shots clear of Cantley heading to the back nine. Four shot lead with nine to play, my friends. Alright, Cantley had a hell of a start, but he's backed off that start. We're four shots clear. Hideki Matsuyama's finished his round. He finished 10 under. If I can get to hold 14 and still be four or five shots at four or five shots ahead, like we are in just the prime position of our career here to do this thing, but we need to stay on it. No mistakes. That's the main thing. I don't even think I need to light the world on fire from this point. But I 100% can't have silly mistakes. That's going to reach the bunker. Holy shit. I've never, ever reached the bunker on this old hitting the stinger. That's crazy, dude. Wow. All right, it won't be the worst shot in the world. It's 125 yards out of the bunker. It'll be fine. I guess the wind is kind of more with us than I've had on this hole previously. But I've never, ever hit it that far with the stinger. And I kind of hit it over swingy and fast. So it kind of oh, was a, an amalgamation of all the, the perfect things to make it go that far. But... Catley's laying back with a three wood. Probably a smart play with this wind, honestly. I could have done something similar. Um, but he's laid way back. He's about 50 yards behind me at least. All right, it's not that bad though. That's 225. Oh my god, he's 100 yards behind me. I'd rather he's be where I am than he is still. I think. He sets for Even though he's in the fairway. Patty, Patty, ice, my man. Guys, by the way, we can become a channel member for as little as $1.99. You guys are, will be getting early access to videos, exclusive videos. Uh, that best of January video that I uploaded, we'll be doing those every month for members specifically um, going forward. Great mm, shot by Patty Eyes. Yeah, put it to 20 foot nice from 225 yards. Not bad at all. Now, green. we need to be careful here because we have a really tap. good lie and the wind is strong behind us. Don't have a club. Fuck. All right, what about this? 
That's going to have to do. The 54 is going to have to do. I'm going to take some off it. Sit. 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 Please sit. Please sit. Please sit. Ah. I thought that was going to be so good for a second. Good Did not want to sit. All right. 18 foot. Got a better date. Can't be still further away, but I have a feeling he's going to make this. He hasn't been making a lot since the, uh, since the start. He's had a few bad holes in a row, and usually they bounce back from the bad holes and start playing some really good stuff. Yep. Okay, and he makes. We're now three shots ahead. We need this to keep our four-shot lead. Breaks a lot, and it's downhill. Huh? Well, it's actually uphill, dead downhill, but and it's fairly flat, to be fair. I think it clearly breaks quite a bit from right to left here. Oh, good effort. Uh, it's a good effort. You can't even complain, son. Alright. So it's a three-shot game now. We head to one of the tougher holes at Augusta here. It's hole 11. And then we head to the famous part three before we head to the easiest part of the course. So, let's try to get our four-shot lead back at 11 here, because the AI always plays this hole like doggy. But watch now, Cantley's played the hard holes, I feel like, really well today. So maybe he'll continue that trend with a birdie here on 11. Playing 540 yards today. Cantley. That is so bad, it's insane. He's going to have like 260 left. <laughs> Yeah, good swing and a good result. 240. As long as it doesn't go right, we're perfect here. That is so golden, it's insane. What a shot, man. Wow. All right, watch us still somehow walk off with the same score here. I'm like 200 yards ahead of him. I am genuinely nearly 100 yards ahead of him again, though. Oh, that's funny. All right, Cantley's going to put it to bloody 10 foot now or something, though, in 240. Look at that view, boy. That's gorgeous, isn't it? Paddy Ice. That's left. Go in the water, please. Please. Oh. Dude, I thought that was going in the water. I got excited for a second. We can make this work. 140. This oh my god, what good. a shot. Oh my god, come on! I want my four shot lead back! I want my four shot lead back! What a shot here at 11! It's magical! Oh, we've been on it today, boys. We've been on it. And this is exactly what we need. Cantley's gonna make that for the par. I'm gonna make it for the birdie. And we're gonna be back to four shots ahead heading to the heading to the twelfth. This Come on. Uh, there's no way he misses this. I, like, I guarantee it. I'd love it if I was around here. Oh my god. I mean, Bye, Charlie. If shot. we make this. Now they it's level. Straight. It's up the hill. It's dead straight. And five oh, shot lead here at Augusta. It's seven to play. Okay. Okay. Stay calm. Stay calm. Seven holes to stay play. calm. Just stay calm. Everybody stay stay fucking calm. Okay, it's happening. Okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. I'm hitting the pitching wedge. This could be a mistake, but I'm gonna do it. How did I underswing that? What a shot. Oh no. We are winning this tournament. There's no way we're not now. I mean, this Golden Bell has been conquered. Game, and we have a chance here right. to really go out. six up with six to play, man. What is happening? This is magical. Of all the moments, this is how well, we play in the final the round of Augusta. This is as well as we've ever played here. He needs to make this realistically. Can he make a 55-footer from deep? Patrick Cantley. Oh, he gave it a run. Oh, we have a chance to go really six up with fight. six to play. To it's time. Right Turning right to left. Slightly. Up the hill. Just bang it in there, son. 
Six up, six to play. Back to back birdies. It's been a round of our dreams. We head to the easiest part of the course and we're already popping off here in Augusta. This is insanity. This is insanity. Patrick Cantley taps in for his par. He's six shots back. He must be feeling like a bomb hit him out of nowhere. We're seven under for the round, by the way, as well. Like, this is magical. A driver, of course. I want a power driver. Can I kind of take it around the corner a little bit? Keep drawing, keep drawing. Ah! Stayed out right. That is unfortunate. It's going to be the mulch. Well, actually, it stays in the light rough. And from 223, and I reckon we can still get it on. I feel good, man. Surely, 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 not even me. Not even I could bottle it from here, boys. Surely. Surely. Cantley hits a good one down the middle. Let's see if All he right. goes for it in two. From 262. He stopped me once. He's here to try and stop me again. But it looks like I fended him off long enough. We've played the, the round of our dreams here, realistically. Imagine coming out here and doing this in round four at Augusta. Do I go for it, is the question. And you know the answer to that. The answer is always a resounding yes, I do. That's too far. All right, that's going to be over the back of the green. But you know what? I'm okay with it. I would prefer this actually gets off the green. Never mind. All right, that's going to be awful. Catley's laid up anyway, so the best he's going to do is a birdie, unless he's Scotty Scheffler's this. How do you do with that one? That was great, Rich. This is the most famous par five in the in the world. One of the reasons why, too, not just the dog leg left that the hole presents. Is he going to zip it to the left? Oh the wow, what a shot, shot. Patrick! All right, Patrick's going to make a birdie for the indeed. first time in a while. But we just need to match him. We need to match him with a birdie. Don't even give him a sniff of success. Don't even give him anything. Give him nothing. You're nothing, Patrick. All right, the break kind of stops at the end, but I'm going to say it breaks like this much. Down the hill. Yeah, it did break a little more than that, to be fair. Wow, and it's downhill way more than I thought. That's off the green. Jesus Christ. I, I came back 20 foot. To be honest, I think we can make this. I think it would be a poor, poor miss if we didn't make this. Oh! Good effort, but it'll a good big lip out. That was a very poor power, in fairness. I left myself in the worst possible position there after the second shot. Like, uh, the worst possible position I could be in on the green, at least. Can't you miss? <laughs> it's not your day, pal. I was going to say, I'm, I'm, I might get a little worried if he starts to pick away at us, but he doesn't even beat us on the hole. <laughs> That's amazing. That is amazing, Patrick. You absolutely suck, sir. Oh, wow. Patty Ice is not so icy today. It's a six-shot lead with five to play. And we're counting down the holes now, my friends. I think we can begin to bask in the glory as we walk around Augusta. Unless we really mess up from here, it's looking this like it's going to be a rosy finish a for your boy. One. And we'll be slipping into that green jacket the green. for the very Two first time. Masters. It is awkward, but I wouldn't say it's one of the, me the most difficult in golf. Hmm. I do find that I do that a lot on the tee, though. I'll miss out to the right. We're in the mulch. We're in the pine straw, son. Patrick, Patrick. Patrick. He's done the bloody same thing as me, I'd say. Not quite as far, so he's going to stay in the fairway. fairway Alright. Patrick Cantlay. We are starting to feel the heat a little bit here. Not from Cantlay, just from the fairway. pressure Let's of winning the Masters. You know? You can clearly see that. You can hit your number, if we can get through that, could get really close. we're looking good. Cantlay. It's a decent one. Falls, a, falls away down the hill. Oh, I have to hit it down right. with this angle. That's stupid. And they took me out of the pine straw. Yeah. That's brain dead. I love that angle. Sarcasm in my voice. That was too far? Yeah, it's going to be pretty much where Cantley is now. <laughs> we'll give him an exact read, actually. 
All right, Gantley, I'll well, give you a read, pal. I'm going to give you the exact read, though, you little sucker. All right, breaks left to right pretty much the whole way. Not that much at the start. A little bit more in the middle. It's not, it's not breaking a whole lot, to be honest. It's breaking a decent amount, but it's more up about the uphill shot here than anything. So I just need to get it to the hole. Oh! Oh! Okay, I made a hit a little too hard, but left ourselves a little tester. Man, I'm I'm really not playing well right now. Like I'm uh, I'm feeling the heat. We're six shots clear, man. Calm down. Calm the hell down and just start making some putts. We don't want any two shot swings. We don't want any two shot swings. All right, good putt for par. All right, five shot lead, four to play. We head to the par five. Now let's birdie this par five and put it to bed. If we birdie this par five, honestly, the, the, it's done. It's a five shot lead, five to play, four to play. Sorry, I am nervous though. We're like I'm, I'm nervous. Even though I'm five shots clear, I'm nervous as hell. <laughs> it's just the fact, the occasion, man. Chantley's taking an iron. Very strange one, to be honest, Patrick. To the right side of the fairway create a big advantage, but the risk of running into the pine straw or the Watch him hit a three wood there into the water now. They play this all so strange, it's insane. I don't, know. I don't understand the way they play this all. Perfection. Coming off that tree, drawing it perfectly, that and that's as side. good as it gets. I think we'll be able to go at this in two, no problemo. 227? We'll make that work for sure. Look at that smile. He knows he's winning the Masters today, boys. He knows it. We can put the second one on the green, just two putt. We're good. No, he's actually lighting up iron iron. Okay. Patrick Iceman. Good shot. He's playing the full layup game. 100 yards left for him. Clearly too much glove. This is... What about this? 210 to carry. I'm going to take a little off this. We'll be fine. I'm even way too far right there, though. Come on, baby. Still ain't even way too far right. Onto the potato penis green. Pretty good shot, though. Pretty damn good shot, man. Let's go. 19 oh, foot for an eagle. Man. Come Take on, now. Goal. Let's go. Looks like it's going to be pretty much where I am. Ooh, it zips back a little bit. No, I don't know that it's much better than mine either, though. He's 20 foot away. Uh, He's going to be putting really first. All right, if he makes it, that like, still doesn't matter, really. <laughs> he has to birdie the last four and hope that I... That would get him to what? 21 under? And hope that I bogey one and then we'll go to a playoff? I mean, I could bogey more than one. That's a possibility. But if I birdie this, I'd have to bogey the last three. Lead is four, but there's not much in this, you know. There's only a slight amount of break in this towards the end. Like, it does pick up a little bit towards the end, but it's not anything really to write home about. I think this is going to be just just fine. Now there. There. That's where it turns. Oh! Oh, my God. They changed the angle. I was like, I thought I thought I was going to see it drop. Now this. Oh, that's unfortunate. All right. Well, this is to go back to five shots clear. Five shots clear, three to play. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. 23 under par. I'm not counting my chickens until they hatch, because I play the last three holes here fairly poorly. Ge fairly poorly, generally. So let's just get through these three holes with three pars, and we win this tournament. I could probably bogey three of them and still win, to be honest, but I don't want to I don't want to put that to, to chance. Can't play with a big draw. Is that going to come back off the hill? Not quite enough. Oh, it's picking up a little speed here. Is it going to keep going down the hill? It's still going. All right. I just have to play these last three holes like Patrick's going to birdie the last three. Because right? then right we kind of force ourselves to play a little bit better. Come on, baby. Talk dirty to me. It's too much. See, I was worried about being short for some reason. So it's too much crap. Come on, keep coming, keep coming. Oh, it stops there, bastard. It's going to be a difficult putt. Yeah. Jesus Christ, is it ever. I literally have to tap this, I think. Just tap it and worry about the line. Oh, 
I mean, I hit that as soft as I could. It's still five foot past the pin. All right, if Cantley makes this, he gets to back to within four. With me having a four footer for par, a little bit of a tester. Thank God, thank God. All right, if this was a two shot swing, I'd be starting to get a little worried. <laughs> it's a bogey free round actually mighty impressive considering our struggles last few holes especially all right boys i think five five shot lead with two to play i think we can start to enjoy it now i think i might have won the masters here we just got to stay in the zone until the 18th hole though stay in the zone until we hold that putt on the last i wish there was like a celebration like when tiger won the masters where you see them like walking up and like high-fiving the crowd and like I, I would love that kind of stuff but i guess that would probably be quite difficult patrick kent knight You've tried your valiant best. You've shot a decent round here, but I've just been on absolute fire. You have an eight under round here going. Patrick Kentley's three under. He had a, a tough stretch throughout the round, and that was really what cost to me at that stretch where he went, I think, bogey, bogey, par on the par five then as well. Um, yeah, I think, uh, I think that's what cost him. But really, nothing cost him. It was just me playing better. Oh, my God. We nearly hit the trees there dead on. We get oh we did we clipped it, bastard. All right, I mean it'll be a longer shot, but it's not the end of the world. Still, I'm still further than Cantley. From the fairway. All right, he's playing a big fade. And I guess the wind is going that way too. It's too long. That's what she said to me always. I don't believe you. Patrick Cantley goes long of the green. That just came and out we crazy. are hopefully going to put the inevitable. cherry on top of these last two holes. I never played these last two well, so it would be nice to play these well for a change. To draw this against the wind a little bit. Because I need to be aware of that tree there. That's not good. Oof. Horrible golf shot. All right, maybe a little flop or a spinner from there will do the trick. We landed on the, on the upslope if we hit a spinner, so that's okay. I'll hit the spinner there. All right, watch the spinner. <laughs> oh, yes. Come on. Come on, baby. Let's go. Can't let you need a chip in. And a miracle. <laughs> Can't let has absolutely had a stinker there. That's a horrible golf shot. All right, guys. I think it's official. We've won the green jacket for the very first time. It's magical. It's brilliant. No one can stop us now. Not Cantley, not Scheffler, not Sung JM. None of them can stop us now. Oh, that's cruel, Cantley. It don't matter though, it's a six shot lead again. With one to play. Imagine I shot limit and exceeded and <laughs> to be fair, even if I double it and Cantley eagled it, I think I still win. Because <laughs> uh, I think double's like the worst you can do in this game, isn't it? Maybe you can get a triple. I'm not sure. It's pretty stupid anyway. The limit they have. All right, can't play. Well done, son. All right, the infamous last hole. I've never played this very well, but I'd love to finish with a birdie. Quite a sight. I'd absolutely love to finish with a birdie. We fit a gorgeous drive, position prime, and we're primed and ready to take this great walk. Yep. I, I don't think it's just about... I don't even think I need to hit a good approach shot. I could literally have a terrible hole here and still win. But, can't lay. You fought valiantly, son. It's not going to be enough. Yeah, that one Pussy that shots one. like that are why. This is for not only the green jacket for the first time, but for the career Grand Slam as well. And maybe at the end of this season, we'll have to retire. Maybe start a new career. Who knows? It's still on that, Is that up the top? No, it's not. That's too much. All right, little finesse seven iron, I think, is the play. That is so good, it's insane. Wow, I went that far. All right. Come back down the hill a little bit. 23 foot a good approach, for a closing a birdie. Like. That's about where Scotty Scheffler buried me from last year. Up the hill here. This is going to play Let's see. 
if we can claim our revenge right here and win at Augusta to start February off right. Patrick Cantley zips it off the green, to be honest. What a horrible, horrible hole for Patrick Cantley to finish on. He's feeling the pressure. He's feeling the pressure. He knows he's lost now as well. It's hard when you're out there and you know you've lost, you know? Like, I always I always struggle watching that when, when people are out there and they've been in contention all week and then there's a few holes left and they know they can't win. It's like watching them. They're so deflated and just not really playing to the, to the best of their ability at all. Chance but this, another birdie. to win the Masters. There's a great deal of success on the greens thus far, but this one's going to be a challenge. Yeah, he just never got that one going. Jesus. That went a ways by, huh? Good thing I didn't need a par. <laughs> All right, Cantley, tap it in. I don't want to see your face anymore, Patrick. Well done. All right, he's left the stage to me. It's a bogey-bogey finish for Cantley. But this is the moment. This is the moment that dreams are made of. I was trying to look at the camera while I did it. Probably a stupid idea. All right. This is the moment that dreams are made of. We are the Masters champion. A tradition unlike any other. Pop that platinum trophy too, baby. Pop that platinum trophy. I'm the go. I'm the go. Come on. God, that feels good. There we go. Yes. We'll see you next time on EA Sports. EGA Tour Golf. Love it. I absolutely love it. I wish they were a little bit longer and more in depth, but we'll have to accept it. Accept the things you cannot change, my friends. We've won the Masters Tournament, and that is something special. We've qualified for the RBC Heritage. Oh, yay. But yeah, if you want to see me complete this season, maybe, we could do um, we could do this season and then maybe retire. I, I think that would be good. I really want to do at least the, the Open at Royal Liverpool because we haven't done the Open at Royal Liverpool yet. I think that would be a good one to do. Um, so maybe we'll just do the, the Open at Royal Liverpool and that will be our, our final tournament, maybe. Um, our final tournament in the career mode. And then I want to maybe start a... I don't know whether I would start another career mode as uh, maybe do a female career mode or something. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. Because we've done it all now in this career mode. I feel like that would be the perfect moment to retire um, if we claim another Open Championship there at Royal Liverpool. How many majors have we won now? I don't even know. Like, I, I think someone has to count and let me know in the comments how many majors we've won. Is it five? I feel like I've won, I've won one of the majors twice, right? I think. I think it might be the Open that we've won twice. But we've won the Masters once. We've won the US Open once. We've won the PGA. Maybe it was the PGA we won twice. I'm not sure. Uh, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. I just got the Platinum Trophy for EA Sports PGA Tour. It feels damn good. I'm not going to post about getting that Platinum until I uh, have this video up for a couple days. But thanks for watching. See you next time. It's been my pleasure to serve you all. Peace out.